close your eyes and focus on your breathing. Breathing in and out. In and out. Very deeply letting go of any worries, anxiety, and tension. Breathing in and out. And as we go through our relaxation process, we now call upon the fire dragons of the light to use their cleansing and transmuting fire to cleanse our aura and etheric bodies of all auric debris, all energies not our own, and all of our own negative energies. Their fire can transmute even the lowest energies. And so it is. Thank you, fire dragons of the light. And continuing to focus on your breath, just following the breath in and out. In. Not changing the rhythm of your breath, just observing each breath as it flows in and out without judgment, just noticing each individual breath as you do this. Starting to connect with the flow, becoming the breath as it flows, easily, softly, rhythmically, in and out. Feeling the softness of your physical body as you sense it becoming softer. Allow it to become heavier, letting go. Noticing your breath become slower and deeper. We now call upon Archangel Jophiel, the beautiful angel full of positivity and light. We ask her to stand at our crown chakra on the top of our head and pour her beautiful white energy the white light down into your crown chakra and flows into your head, down your forehead, smoothing any frowns, down your ears, your eyes, your cheeks, and your jaw, relaxing as it passes through your body. And this beautiful white angelic energy 
continues down through your neck into your shoulders softening soothing relaxing your shoulders releasing any tension as the white light goes down your back down your arms through your elbows your wrists to the very fingertips of your hands and the white light is going down your chest into your heart soothing your heart down into your stomach your intestines the white light is going down leaving behind only healing angelic energy as it passes through your hips and your rear and goes down to your right leg through your knee your calves, your ankles, your feet. And the white angelic energy goes down through your left leg, through your knees, your calves, your ankle, and your foot. This beautiful white energy is soothing, softening, and healing, allowing you to feel safe and relaxed. And as you feel your body vibrating this white angelic energy. You feel more comfortable and at ease. You feel all resistance being drained away. And every cell in your body is opening like a golden flower and releasing light. And you're opening to the angelic realms. Archangel Michael, the Archangel of Protection, stands before you now in his glorious blue light. He places a blue cocoon of protection around you and you are safe and secure. In a moment, I'm going to ask your guardian angel to come in and connect with you. We all have guardian angels with us for our entire lifetime, regardless of a religious affiliation or belief. Your guardian angel is with you always. So once I ask your angel in, you may feel a sensation or you may have a waft of scent or a sense of closeness. You may feel your guardian angel touching your aura. 
where you may feel a wonderful feeling of love or a warm glow. You can just relax in the knowledge that your angel is with you. We now ask for your guardian angel to come close and touch you in any way that is appropriate for you now. Whatever you experienced, know that your angel is now with you, kneeling in front of you, looking at you with eyes of unconditional love. Nothing you can think, do, or say can stop your angel from loving you. We now ask your guardian angel to open and cleanse your heart. See your angel placing their hands on your heart. A soft pink light is flowing from their hands into your heart and filling it with love. Old hurts are being soothed and released. This warm pink light is going deep into your heart and surrounding it with healing. The energy charge of old hurts are being dissolved. Feel the door of your heart opening wider. Your essence is love. All is well. Let go of the old and let anything in your heart that is not love flow out and be dissolved by your angel. And as you feel calmer and clearer and more relaxed, your heart is opening more and more. And this warm pink light spreads from your heart and radiates throughout your body. Your guardian angel now stands beside you and takes you by the hand on a journey down a golden path. You walk hand in hand down the golden path, down the path to a set of ten rose quartz crystal stairs. You both start walking up the stairs, up the first step, to the second, the third, the fourth, the fifth, the sixth, the seventh, eighth. Ninth and the tenth, and at the top 
you enter into the most beautiful garden. It's a perfect day. There's a warm blue sky, soft white puffy clouds. The grass is green and soft and springy. There are beautiful flowers in the garden of all colors. And there are tall and majestic trees where you can hear birds singing a beautiful chorus. Butterflies dance in the air passing in front of you. Somewhere in the garden is a fountain. You can hear the water flowing and see it sparkling in the sunlight. Take a moment to enjoy the beauty of this garden. Your guardian angel now guides you to sit on a bench and sits down beside you. Now ask your guardian angel for their name. Take the first name that comes to you. If you're in any doubt, ask how to spell the name. Trust in what you get. Think your angel's name lovingly a few times. Now you hear your angel saying your name lovingly a few times. Your angel takes your hand once again and you walk deeper into the garden, into a place of vast, rolling green hills and valleys. Within this space, you see several large, orange, translucent pyramid structures. There is one pyramid that is the largest, connected by orange tunnels to the other smaller pyramids. You and your angel walk into the largest orange pyramid. This pyramid represents your heart and heart chakra. As you both enter in, you find a vast hall with beautiful, comfortable chairs at the front of the hall. Your angel guides you to sit down in one of the chairs and relax. The other smaller pyramids outside contain people from this life and past lives who have hurt you, disappointed you, abandoned you, or betrayed you. Anyone who has left a negative emotional cord into your heart. Therefore, how many small pyramids you see is unique to each of you. We 
We now call upon and invite Archangel Samuel, Raguel, Raphael, Mother Mary, Lady Nada, Kuan Yin, Jesus, the Seraphim, and Archangel Michael to enter into your heart pyramid now. They are here now to help you and support you in releasing all past heartache and hurts and cutting energetic cords that no longer serve you. The seraphim now invite those who have left the deepest hurt on your heart this lifetime into the hall. They enter from their smaller pyramid, coming through the orange tunnels into your hall and sit in the chair before you. Seeing this person or persons may bring up some emotions, and that is okay. Breathe and release them. Cry if you need to. Breathing deeply in. and out to release. Breathing deeply in and out. Take a moment now to release any negative emotions you might feel. And now, use this time to speak to this person in front of you, in your mind, or out loud, and tell them things that were unsaid during the relationship, but weigh heavily on your heart. Let it all out, and let it go. The angels are supporting you as you do this. They are giving you the courage to really release and say what you need to. As you speak and release, the person standing in front of you starts fading, as if their physical body is becoming ethereal, more transparent as you speak and let it all go. 
Observe this happening now. Just before they disappear entirely, Jesus, Jesus comes to stand beside you and holds your hand, giving you the strength to help you forgive them. Forgiveness does not mean that you condone what they did, but instead it releases all negative energies within you that are clinging to the feelings of unforgiveness. After the person disappears, Archangel Michael uses his sword to cut the cords to the tunnel and the smaller pyramid that this person was in. Both disappear. Your energetic cords to this past hurt are now cut from your heart chakra and your sacral chakra. Feel the lightness of being after the removal of this cord that was a weight within your body. Breathe deeply in for a count of four one, two, three, four, and out, one, two, three, four, and one more time, one, two, three, four, and out, one, two, Three, four. You can relax now in the absolute certainty that this person is no longer affecting your current heart and life. You may need to return to this pyramid again to keep releasing and healing until there are no longer any smaller pyramids connected to your heart pyramid. And that is okay. Healing is a continuing process that brings more light back into us each step of the way. Emotional hurts may have dimmed our light, but it is our divine right to shine brightly, full of self-love, full of love for others, romantic or otherwise. We now thank Archangels Shamuel, Raguel, Raphael, Michael, Mother Mary, Lady Nada, Kuan Yin, Jesus, and the Seraphim for assisting us in clearing and healing your heart today. Your guardian angel now takes your hand, guides you out of your pyramid, 
out through the green valley, walking hand in hand back through your beautiful garden. Back to the rose court stairs. And you both start walking down these stairs. Down to nine, eight, seven, to the sixth, the fifth, the fourth, the third, the second, and the first. And you're back down to the golden path. You're walking down the golden path. Down the path. And back into your room. Thank your guardian angel and remember that they are always with you and willing to help. All you have to do is ask. You can slowly start coming back into your body, to the awareness of your physical body. Wiggling your toes, your fingers, stretching, becoming more conscious of your breath and your energy. Feel yourself glowing, the cleansing, healing white, angelic energy. For you have just unloaded and released a great deal of negative energies and cords and can now enjoy your lightness of being and open heart. Ready to welcome wonderful, new, and improved relationships in your life. And so it is.